Hello, my name is Sander and welcome back to another video about the inventory mass asset. Today I'm going to show you how to create an equipment system. You go to the master system and create an, oops, an equipment and this equipment uh, or the character system. And let me show you some important things. If you created or, or, or if you already created a tooltip, be uh, sure that the tooltip is underneath the, uh, every inventory. Otherwise, uh, you get problems with the tooltip, and the tooltip could be under the inventory. Okay, uh, let me go to the equipment system now. Uh, the equipment system has the inventory sc uh, uh, script it says, just with some. Um, uh, the same settings, but there are some settings which are disabled, and the play inventory is uh, not really important for you. Um, this tag is pretty important, otherwise you get some errors. So l please let it tag as equipment system. Uh, you can change the height of it, or the width of it, and the slot size and the icon size, like the inventory as uh, as well. And um, let me show you now what you can change with the character system or what character system you can create. Um, let me change the padding between to five and wait, and the bit this here also to five and like this and let us change the top padding to this. Um, now, when you maybe want to add a character model, you can take this on the top of the slots or how you like this. Uh, let me take this back to the default because. I uh, actually like more the default one and don't forget how I said take the equipment system um, there oh wait I took the slots I want this panel and yeah and you can add here you click on it and you can add here um, just your uh, your model which you want to have in it but be sure when you add something like a model in it and uh, take the children like this um, like I just take the panel now underneath the slots otherwise uh, you get some problems because my script is working with child uh, like this when you want to have something like this in it uh, just like uh, take this there um, okay let me go deeper now. Now we've got the script equipment system. Um, you can see there are the slot amounts, uh, and when you change this, uh, it's getting updated as well. And here you can uh, define which slot, um, um, yeah, which slot has which item type in it. And I show you this with chests. And you can uh, have multiple uh, slots with uh, the same item types as well. So uh, the first slot has chest, the second one is a chest, and the third one is nothing now at the moment. But um, uh, I let it like this now. And it also has uh, the inventory design script, and you can change the font as well. Uh, the position is the same, I guess, and I change this one as well to mm, this one, and take this white, and take the inventory design to another one now. Like the panel of the tooltip is okay, I guess. And take this and change the size. Don't forget this. Uh, change the color. Don't forget this. And now we go to the slots. Wait. Slot. If you got this bug sometimes, it uh, appears from Unity. Um, like you see, uh, there were only two uh, settings. Just uh, click on another game object and click on it and go to slot design and you can change this now. And now take the slot and change the color as well. And you can change the padding of it. Like you don't want to have this uh, there like this. Uh, like this uh, there. And the right side as well, like this. Ah, it's uh, I guess okay. Um, yeah, I've added um, some items to my inventory. Uh, how you see here, uh, these items are all items which are described as uh, item type of chest, and I've added them like this here. And when I start now, and I activate them, and when I consume them in this um, with the script, right click only, and you see it's um, on the right side of it. 
then when I click again on it, the next one is it's only it's checking firstly if there uh, if the first one is null if or if there's something in, yes yeah, there's something in and it's getting it uh, it's it's taking the next slot. Is this empty? Yeah, it's taking uh, this in. Okay, and when they are both full of it, uh, it's getting uh, yeah, replaced. So um, it's always ch changing then. Um, yeah, this is about the character system. I'm gonna show you how now to add an item type. You just uh, search for the item type here for the script and double click on it and you can add s item types uh, how many you like. Um, how I did here it was pretty easy. Um, let me go now to the equipment system. It says it's working like the inventory uh, inventory system. You see here th the the uh, the title as well. Here are the slots, and this is how this works. I hope you liked it. Uh, see you later to the hotbar uh, tutorial. Bye bye.